I'm Robbie the robot. I'm watching TV to learn various behavior to help people. I'm a senior lecturer in the Department of Computer Science at Yale University and my research is focused on robotics and artificial intelligence. How did you come up with the ideas of designing Robby the robot? Basically we are looking for uh, something some some as a companion or a support for the uh, way we are moving towards as a aging populations and uh, the idea is to how to help these people when they are alone or somebody to kind of it's not a replacing the care or things like that we are looking into some kind of a assistance then we looked into the way the monsia people you know are taken care of in this country for example carer they are struggling you need to specialize specialized trained carer who can take care of those people who are having the monsia and uh, while doing all these kind of things we got the idea why can't we develop some technology as a as who can help to those carer who is taking care of these people with dementia uh, we have other chronic diseases for example obesity is and mental health problem uh, often mental health uh, you know kind of uh, disease it, it can be displayed through uh, behavioral aspects of those people so we are also looking forward in that direction as well so, so this is the the work we have done so far is it is the it is the it's the first step requirement to recognize now how that this once you recognize how you going to put into the system it is all dependent dependent on the whether the how the care workers wants which way how gp or our no physicians or doctors want to see the information so basically in case of any emergency we can have a something like a dial number it can dial so uh, no very aggressive and and, and no can't control uh, harming self harming is some people them and people as a self harming so it can dial the uh, to the doctors or the gp or the loved one and then strict connection to uh, maybe put some camera on so they can see what's going on second things it can do is also play some music some videos to distract to that person let's say example if it is connected to the network then it can play some um, uh, some kind of a um previous memory or a wonderful memory or some music so that can distract the persons and will be calm down so that is other thing the other thing also it can keep track of the how many times in a day the person is become aggressive how long so these informations could be used by the care give providers or the gp to understand the behavioral aspects for example given certain drugs or dose how it is changing those behavior so those are the things quite important for the future so we are looking in that direction as well